One, two, three, let's suit up! So I think we're gonna start, we're gonna finish this uh, commentary, well th we're gonna finish this, uh, the DLC review because it's, there's really no more, no more, no much, not much of a point to it since we are, uh, there's already a lot of channels talking about it, giving it their opinions and stuff, so, um, we're gonna finish it, um, I think, uh, well right now we're gonna decide if we're gonna, we're gonna, um, swords and we're going to decide if we should just uh, post them both. Of, we should post both videos today, so that we don't have to go like so we can uh, post something new tomorrow. So it's not going to be like uh, like another review on the map. And I already gone through two, and so these are the last two collision <laughs> and uh, the other map, Behemoth. And I'm going to give my opinion on this map, and uh, this is one, actually this is my top favorite map, and that is because it reminds me of somewhat of a, of a new, of a new map, no, somewhat of, somewhat of an old map from old games, uh, specifically talking about Crossfire, sh Crossfire Shipyard, if you haven't played the game, or if you haven't played the map, it, like, it reminds me of it. Yeah, so that's why we. That's why. Well, I, well, that's why I chose it to be top one. And that's why I. I don't. I don't like uh, skipping it. It's one of my favorite maps. Most of the time, when I play this map, I go underground for some reason, and there's where I will. In personal personal experience, there's where I faced people more more most of the time, or sometimes there'd be someone on on uh, the middle of the. <coughs> Entrance to the uh, to the underground tunnel, which would be on the ceiling, if I'm not wrong. There's where I find most of the people. I do travel on the sides, but I don't do I don't do it as much as I do when I go on the underground and the tunnels. And I was lost in this game again. It was just my first time playing it on a night in the night when they drop. And we're gonna find. I'm gonna ask my brother right now if. We should just upload both of them and see what he says. Yes, upload both. I say both. Yes, we can upload both of them. Okay, so he's gonna give you his opinion on his side, what he thinks of the maps, and I'm gonna hand it. I hand him down the mic. It's a pretty cool map. I mean, uh, there's a. Uh, it's not completely symmetrical, but you know, it's not your typical. Uh, what you gonna call it? Uh, Nuketown carrier? No, was it carrier? Sh the boat map from uh, Black Ops Two. Hijack. Hijack. There you go. Um, it's not a complete symmetrical map, but it's not bad either. Um, I definitely do think it's a it's a it's 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 a fun map, and that it only hurts when uh, people camp. Um, you know, not everybody uses the underpass. Not everybody uses the, uh, yeah, not everybody uses the middle pass, the underpass, which is cool. I mean, you know, I like it because what are you going to be doing in the underpass? You know, most of the gun battles happen, like, right around the area where my brother is. And uh, I have no problems with this map. This map, actually, I did, uh, I, I got, I adapted to this map a lot faster than I did to the other maps. And if I know you guys are playing the, um, maps will, I don't know if you guys will agree or agree to, or disagree with me, but it seems to be the easier one to just get a hang of. It's a small map. It's a very small map uh, compared to the other ones. The Dome remake is bigger than this, I believe, in my opinion. Um, there's just more areas where you can go. This map seems to play big, but it's not really. Um, and again, that goes because people don't really use the underpass. The... Stop poking your damn nose. And then, um, the, what was the other map? The Aztec, the Aztec one, um, that one is, 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 it seems to be bigger than this one. And that's because, yeah, people do seem to use the underpass in those passages a lot. 
And uh, it's the one of the most difficult to play because a lot of people seem to just find camp spots in that map. Uh, but yeah, compared to compared to all those, the, these are straightforward. You know, people are gonna end up usually where my brother is right now, or right in front of that building in the windows. Um, if anything, there are gonna be a couple that try to camp um, in the middle building. Uh, uh, he just uh, the one to his left. Yeah, the one to the far left. That one he was looking at. Um, there, there are people usually in there because they come up from the underpass sometimes when they do use it. Other times they're just trying to run away, trying to get their health back, trying to regen. So yeah, I mean, in my opinion, it's it's not a bad map. It's it's cool. I adapt to it fast. But again, my favorite map for me in the game would probably have to be um, the Dome remake. And it's not because I know how to play it or anything. But it's because, I mean, it's just dome. You know, it's, it's you gotta like dome. Uh, you know, there's not many underpasses other than the back side of dome. But I mean, there's no underpasses. The underpasses, uh, kind of again, I'm alright with them though. So yeah, guys, that's my opinion on them. If you guys are thinking about getting the map packs, I think you should get them. I don't know what my brother's gonna say. Well, it's, just, it's up to you. Either you like them or you don't. Alright, guys. We're going to make another video after this one. So, see ya. Bye. See ya.